Tatiana. Hello, I'm Lillian. I'm Tiana. I'm Bobby. And I'm Camille. We're representing Lincoln High. And we are the City of Ladies. This city is built on the bones of women who die thinking, I'm, I'm not, not good enough. enough. It is glued together with the blood of women who are told, I, I asked for it. it. Fires are kindled with magazine spreads dictating that we, we shouldn't, shouldn't love, love ourselves. ourselves. We should cultivate our bodies to gratify men and not to accomplish what we want to. For years you have heard the sounds of our city rising. We have built from the ground up. We will build this city for the women like me. The, the girls who have been beaten and have never felt comfortable in the body they were given because that's not very ladylike and boys will be boys have become the norm in this society. The bodies lie, stacked up, rising high, every woman to ever achieve and get knocked down. Our walls are built of broken limbs and bodies seem too fragile to wield hammers. Our walls have been rising for years. Those who are broken are welcomed with open arms. We are building the city for a girl born in 1930. We hid her paintings in the attic next to ideas of a future worth waiting for. We are building the city for her daughter, my mother, who stayed in a marriage that left her too familiar with the sound of her own crying. She stayed for her children. She stayed for me. We are building the city for my friend Sarah, who was told that because she had alcohol in her system, she was not raped. We are building the city for Dylan Farrow, because society begins by assuming she is lying. We are building the city for my cousin Stephanie, who thinks there is a hierarchy in life that goes God, then man, then woman. It's her job to be submissive. Her role is limited to the love she craves from two distant men. We are building the city so they can have a destination, so they can stop living for other people and, and just live. We are breaking like waves on these walls, watching, watching them, them rise like a fever, but for once we don't feel sick. If this is creation, this, this is, is a self-determined purpose. We are prophets who can finally stop using the name anonymous. We know who we are. I think it's worth building for them. For Tiana and Lillian and Bobby and Camille and my grandmother and every other lady who's been beaten into the dust and denied opportunity she's told she doesn't deserve. We are building this city for ourselves. Because when I walk alone at night, heavy footsteps behind me compel me to cross to the other side of the street. Men catcall when I am out with my friends. We are building this city for ourselves. Because I've never felt more trapped in the way that stereotypes engulf a culture. We are looking for refuge in a place to call our own. I shouldn't have to feel scared. We have been in the shadows for too long. We are building this city for anyone who has been oppressed and anyone who has ever felt like they need to build a wall to feel safe, to feel respected. This, this is for you. Because you deserve a sidewalk you feel safe on. Because your home should not feel like a trap. Because, because the faces around you should be able to love you as an equal. This is for you. This, this is, is for us. us.